السلام علیکم اسٹوڈینٹس ہوپ یو آل فائیو اسٹوڈینٹس آج ہم بایو کلاس 11 چیپٹر نمبر 15 ایکسرسائز لانگ کوشچن آنسر سالو کریں گے سو لیٹس اسٹارٹ فرسٹ کوشچن ہمارے پاس ڈسکرائب گرین ہاؤس ایفیکٹ گیو دی کانسیکوینسز اف انکریز ان گرین ہاؤس گیسز وٹ از گرین ہاؤس ایفیکٹ دا گرین ہاؤس ایفیکٹ is a natural process that occurs when certain gases in the earth atmosphere such as carbon dioxide methane water vapors nitrous oxide and ozone trap heat from the sun keeping the planet warm enough to support life how it works solar radiation enters the earth atmosphere The radiation is absorbed by the earth surface warming it infrared radiation is emitted back into the atmosphere greenhouse gas is absorbed and we emit infrared radiation trapping heat consequences of increased greenhouse gases excessive greenhouse gas emissions enhance the natural greenhouse effect leading to environmental consequences such as global warming rising temperature average 1 degree celsius since 1880 climate change alteration in precipitation pattern sea level rise and extreme weather events sea level rise melting glacier and ice sheet coastal erosion and ocean acidification decreased ph level harm marine ecosystem سوشی اکنامک کانسیکوینسز دیز انکلوڈ فوڈ سیکیورٹی امپیکٹ آن ایگریکلچر کراپ یلڈ اینڈ فوڈ اویبلٹی ہیومن ہیلتھ انکریزڈ ڈیزیز اسپریڈ ہیٹ اسٹریس اینڈ مورٹیلٹی اکنامک ڈسٹرپشن ڈیمیج ٹو انفراسٹرکچر انکریزڈ کاسٹ فار ہیلتھ کیئر اینڈ ایمرجنسی ریسپانس واٹر اسکیسٹی changes in precipitation pattern affect fresh water availability specific consequences of key greenhouse gases carbon dioxide increased carbon atmospheric carbon dioxide contributes to ocean acidification methane potent greenhouse gas with significant agricultural and industrial sources nitrous oxide contributes to stratospheric ozone depletion mitigation species reduce fossil fuel consumption increase renewable energy sources enhance energy efficiency carbon capture and storage sustainable land use practices international cooperation paris agreement which was made in 2015 global commitment to limit warming to 1.5 degrees celsius next is united nation framework convention on climate change unfccc next question is what is succession give the stages of primary succession on barren rock succession is the gradual and sequential process of ecosystem development and change involving the replacement of one community of organism by other over time types of succession There are two types of succession primary and secondary primary succession occurs on newly exposed or barren surface where no soil or vegetation existed before secondary succession occurs on surfaces where soil and vegetation were previously present stages of primary succession first stage is pioneer stage which uh, lasts for about 1 to 10 years in this colonization by pioneer species like lichens mosses and algae occur weathering and erosion of rock surface and initial soil formation through physical and chemical processes next stage is soil formation stage which lasts for about 10 to 100 years development of primitive soil structure increase in soil organic matter and the establishment of simple plant communities like mosses and ferns next is vegetation establishment stage 100 to 500 years expansion of plant communities grasses and shrubs 
development of root system and soil nutrient cycling and uh, enrichment next is uh, transition stage 500 to 1000 years shift from pioneer to intermediate species increased biodiversity development of complex ecosystem interaction next is climax stage 1000 plus years establishment of stable mature ecosystem maximum biodiversity self sustaining ecosystem with balanced nutrient cycles factors influencing eco uh, succession are climate topography soil type distribution frequency and intensity and species dispersal at colonization examples of primary succession are glacier retreat volcanic island formation and coastal rock formation key characteristics sequential replacement of species gradual changes in ecosystem structure and function increasing complexity and biodiversity next question is give the significance of coral reef explain the effect of ocean acidification on coral reef ecosystem significance of coral reef is coral reefs are vital ecosystem providing tuberous benefits ecological significance Biodiversity hotspots, home to 25% marine species, nursery grounds, shelter from shelter for juvenile, uh, juvenile fish and invertebrates, shoreline protection, barrier gas stoves and rear water quality maintenance, filter pollutants and sediments. Next is economic importance, fisheries, sport commercial and subsistence fishing. Tourism generate billions in revenue. Coastal protection estimated value of nine billion dollar annually. Medicinal discoveries sources of new medicine. Social significance. Food security provide livelihood for millions. Cultural importance. Spiritual and traditional significance and recreation. Popular destination for diving and snorkeling. Effect of ocean acidification on coral reefs. Ocean acidification occurs when carbon dioxide absorbs into sea water, increasing acidity. Impact on coral reef: reduced coral calcification, decreased coral growth, increased coral dissolution, eroding existing coral structure, shift in species composition, favoring dull calcifying organism, and decreased biodiversity, loss of habitat and species. Consequences Decreased fisheries, impact on fish population, economic losses, decline in tourism and coastal protection, increased vulnerability to storms and ruin, loss of ecosystem service, water quality regulation. Factors contributing to ocean acidification are rising carbon dioxide emission, increased sea surface temperature, and changes in uh, ocean circulation. Mitigation strategies reduce carbon dioxide emission, establish marine protected area, promote sustainable fishing practice, and support coral reef restoration. Examples of coral reef conservation efforts include the Great Barrier Reef Conservation Plan, the Caribbean Coral Reef Initiative, and the Coral Reef Alliance. Data and statistics 30% of coral reefs are already destroyed. 50% of coral reefs at risk by 2030 and 90% of coral reefs at risk by 2050. Sources National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, NOA, Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change, IPCC, and World Wildlife Fund, WWF. Preserving coral reefs require addressing ocean acidification and climate change. Next question is describe glass red ecosystem in Pakistan. Pakistan grassland are temperate and subtropical, covering approximately 10% of country area. Types of grassland Three types temperate grassland, found in Potohar Plateau, Zad Kashmir, subtropical grasslands found in Punjab and Sindh, and alpine meadows found in Himalayan region. Characteristics Dominant vegetation, grasses, shrubs, and wildflowers. Climate temperate to subtropical with varied precipitation. Soil 
varied from fertile to poor nutrient content biodiversity sport variety of flora and fauna flora grasses for example cynodon and dactylon and shrubs for example acacia and prosopis wild flowers for example astrace and fabaceae fauna include mammals for example Uriel, chinkara and black buck birds for example sea sea pa uh, partridge and black partridge reptiles for example indian cobra russian weeper ecosystem services grazing ground for livestock watershed protection soil conservation and carbon sequestration threats overgrazing land degradation climate change human settlement and agri agriculture expansion conservation efforts national parks and wildlife sanctuaries protected areas for example ubia national park sustainable grazing practices and community based conservation initiatives regional variations puthar plateau temperate grasslands with cold winter punjab subtropical grassland with hot summer sindh subtropical grassland with dry conditions importance livestock production biodiversity conservation ecosystem services cultural significance so students hamari allow ko shibi complete ho chuke hain hopefully aapko samajh aa gaye honge if you have any doubt you can ask in comment section please like share and subscribe my youtube channel thank you